Let's have a look on the assignment of week 3, which is about the Caesar cipher. This cipher is actually a simple encryption technique. So each letter in the plain text becomes substituted by another letter. And these letters are always a fixed number down the alphabet. So if we have this fixed number equals to 5, then A becomes an F, B becomes a G and so on. One way to solve this task is to use a dictionary. And uh, I have already prepared one, so I just copy it in. So you see my dictionary is called substitution. And what you can see, I have a key A and the value for this key is F. The next key is B and the value for it is G and so on and so on until the Z becomes an E. So what can we do with this? So if I can say, for example, subs print substitution and then say A, then you see not the A, but the F is printed out because the key A goes to the value F. OK, then let's start to do this program. So the first thing what we have to do is to get a sentence and we have to ask for an input. So please enter a sentence, copy, and we say our plain text is equal to the input. Um, please enter a sentence. And then, as argued in the exercise, it is good to only have lowercase letters. So the next thing what we do is we say plain text is equal to plain text dot lower. So we use this method lower, we change each letter into its lower equivalent. So let's give it a try and uh, say what happens. Print plain text. Yeah, we do some big letters and some small letters. And you see, they're all replaced by their small, small, um, lower equivalents. So now let's go real. Now we have to go and iterate over the plain text character by character. And then we have to convert or substitute each character and put it into a new string called secret letter. And this one, um, secret text, and this one we have to declare first. So we have to initialize it. And now let's loop over our text for character in plain text and now we have to be careful because the text could consist of non-letter characters like a space or a, um, exclamation mark or something like that. So we first better check if the requested character is in our substitution dictionary. So we check if character in substitution and only then we replace it. So character becomes substituted, substitution by its carry. And the non-substitutable um, characters simply remain uh, as they are. And now we have to add this character to our text, secret text plus equal to character. And finally, we have to print it out. Print secret, oh, sorry, secret text. Now let's give it a try. Python is cool. Do some quotation, exclamation marks. And what you can see, it seems to be converted. That's it.